What is up guys? My name is Josh. This is Drunk on Shadows Gaming. Uh, I'm coming at you with another episode of Games with Gold. And uh, I've been kind of slacking this month because there was one earlier in the month. And uh, it was for a Telltale Games um, game <laughs> uh, that you guys have probably seen before. It is um, The Wolf Among Us. So you probably know Telltale Games to be more of a storytelling kind of game. Like a, like a, like a, you play mainly like a movie, basically. And, um, that's what this, this game is. Um, I've seen a little bit on it. I've seen a little bit of footage on it, but I've, I haven't seen like anything to like spoil anything. So we'll see how this goes. Uh, I'm just going to show you guys where in the marketplace it is. So when you go to your Xbox Live or your Xbox uh, home screen, don't listen to me. Um, it's going to be in the right. Oh, this this way. This God, it's this this way. It's going to be right in the the corner, right on the right side of the screen. It'll say Games with Gold. I can't English today for some reason. <laughs> and here it is, right here, The Wolf Among Us. Look at that, Ricky Rose Rose online. So cool. All right, so. So you can check out other people streaming it, live streaming it, and stuff. Um, obviously, it looks a little weird. It's got a different kind of uh, animation thing. Um, to see how much. Normally, it's twenty five dollars. Normally, it's twenty five dollars. I'm also going to be doing a review on Sunset Overdrive too. Sunset Overdrive has been out for a while. It looks really cool. Look really cool. Normally, thirty bucks. I downloaded this as well, and I downloaded Saints Row, but, but yeah, so I'm going to be reviewing that later, but right now we're going to go and review The Wolf Among Us. I'm probably not, I'm obviously not going to get through the whole story today, but um, if you guys do want to see more, make sure you comment down below if you want to see more, and like this video if you'd like to see more, let me know how you like it, okay? Because then I will uh, I will do more episodes of The Wolf Among Us. But right now I'm trying to stick to around 25 to 30 minutes. So I try to keep these episodes shorter. Well, medium kind of length. Because I know it gets kind of boring like later on in the videos. And you don't want me to just drag it on forever. Unless it's a good game. So And usually I do that on the live stream. So... You guys let me know how you you like this. It's a WB, really. Vertigo, huh? I didn't know that. So this is it. The Wolf Among Us. It's gotten a lot of good reviews. So we'll see how it is. Let's, uh, let's just jump right into it. The see like the the animations and everything look pretty cool. Like it, it looks like a pretty crazy, like trippy, like graphic game. It looks pretty cool though. So we'll start episode one. We'll see where that goes. And uh, if you guys like it, if you want to see more, let me know, and I will play more for you guys. Let me see if I can stay out of the way of like the opening cinematics and stuff, okay? This game series, okay. Well, it was once upon a time in New York City, there lived a community of fairy tale characters known as Fable Town. Fables who lived there arrived hundreds of years ago after they were exiled from their homelands. Through the use of a magical spell called Glamour, they protected their secret community from the mundane world. Sheriff Bigby Wolf protects them from each other. Okay, so you're the sheriff, right? Tomorrow well, 5 today, again if you missed it, a record for the date. Hottest ever in June, uh, 103 now, and that humidity looks low, but remember, the hotter the air is, the more moisture it can hold. So 103 with 31% humidity is a lot more humid than, say, 73 with 31% humidity. And it is muggy out there. <laughs>
Mr. Toad. Oh, shit. Big B! Listen, mate, I, I know I don't look human. It's a problem, I get it. I just stepped out the apartment for just a second to see what kind of damage this drunk shit is doing. Just cut me a break, yeah? I'll get me glamour first thing in the morning. Cross my arm. No need to kick up a fuss. I've heard enough of your excuses, Toad. This is unacceptable. If you can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. You can't send me up to live with those animals. You know what I mean. Go see a witch. Get a glamour. Big B, they're bleeding me dry, mate. The quality of the spell goes down, but the rates keep climbing up. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? It's not even really worth dwelling on at this point. You're telling me to get it together. Whatever it costs, it's worth it. You don't want me catching you out of glamour again. Fuck you now! See? This is what I called you about, Sheriff. You're just gonna stand there, do something, Big B, before he completely tears up the place! Oh, thanks for that, Big B. You're a real gentleman. Oh! This is the last straw, Big B. He has to go. So what set him off? Who knows why so I'm just gonna be in the corner drink. now because it's basically the whole thing is a cinematic. Not sure he ever stopped. <laughs> I thought it was gonna introduce well, something and then there. get into the game, but it just jumped right into the story. Obviously. So. Furry prick of shite. Tell me how to spend my money. Dad, the lights are shaking again. What did I say? You want a big bad wolf to take you away? No. Then get that fuck back inside. Wow. You're gonna know who I fucking am, you hear me? Hey, look at me. Oh, okay. Let's go. So you move with one arm or one stick and then the other stick is the cursor basically. Let's go over here. Take a good look. Know who I am now? Hey, look at me. Get off of it's a ripped off matchbook or something. The things you pick up can be useful later. Somebody dead. God damn you! No way. Whoa, 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 hey, hey, hey! You've got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid <laughs> Ew. Well, that's I'll rude. Fucking kill you! Alright, everyone. <laughs> what are you gonna fucking do, huh? Get the fuck out of the way before you get the axe again. Woody, this is your last warning. If you keep on like this, I won't have any choice but to put you down. Put me down? You got a shit fucking memory, Wolf. That's not how it went last time. This isn't last time. Oh, shit. I don't... Okay, I... Gonna watch me kill you. And it'll be her turn. Was I supposed to okay, I'm getting my ass beat. Oh 
shit. He gonna oh, he's grabbing the axe, okay. I had to put him down. Oh, he's still alive, he's still alive. You should probably get out of here. Look. I'm not leaving until I get what's mine. You're not getting shit, bitch. I'll fucking put you on the ground. Shut up. Oh, fucking shit. You bugged my jaw, you bastard. And still you talk. Fuck you. Shit. What are you doing here? These lips are sealed. Gosh, hang on. Look, this is just the start of a shitty night for me. I just need the money he owes me, then I can go. What the hell is going on? What happened? A little misunderstanding that turned into a real shit show. Don't worry, you saw the best bits. There's more where that came from, girly. Knock it off! Are you alright? I'm hunky-dory. Thanks for asking. Why was he hitting you? He asked me if I recognized him, knew who he was. I said I didn't. He started beating on me. Then you showed up, started beating on him. That about cover it, hon? I'm the woodsman, you whore. I saved Little Red Riding Hood from this monster. I cut this fucker open and filled his belly full of <laughs> stones. And threw him in the fucking river. That's who the fuck I am, you stupid bitch! Hey, what did I say? I said be nice, or you wait out. Come on. How? Does am I dead? Am I dead? My car. Yeah. <clears throat> Give me a second. Oh, no, by all means. Take your time. Make yourself comfortable. So, uh, how good is your insurance? I can't be mad at you. I called you, and you come to help. I can't be mad. But even when you help, things end up more fucked than they started. <laughs> Oops. Well. At least you're not fucking dead. Come on. I'm a drug dealer. Oh my god, I can't keep pushing the button! He's got a... What are you doing? I'm just getting what he owes me. You all right back there? I mean, your eyes and the teeth? You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Not if I can avoid it. Great. 
The guy's got an axe in his brain. He's not feeling that. It's more for me. He'll be. I'll kill you, you fucking bitch. What is he? <laughs> He's had enough. He's a fable. Son of a bitch can take plenty. Oh. Just come on. Hmm. Is she like a prostitute? Here. Thanks. Well, the matchbook came in handy. Who do you work for, really? A pimp? These lips are sealed. That's Sorry. a pimp. I don't think he's taking shit today. Hey, you like my ribbon? If you don't answer my questions, I can't help you. I'm answering them the best that I can. I feel like we've met before. We probably have. We all sort of knew each other at one point or another. But things change, I guess. I guess. So, is he the big bad wolf? <laughs> She's... Totally. <laughs> I like that last thing. Stop. We don't have to make any more of a thing out of it than it already is. It's not just about you. I can't have him running around the city in the state he's in. Good, because I was just starting to worry it was all about me. That's not what I mean. was the OJ? A hundred. I'm guessing it'd be bad for you to show up empty-handed. I'll be fine. Let's see, I've got, uh, it's 20, 40, 7, 8, 58. It's all I got. Uh, it'll help, right? Take it. It's okay. I'll be fine. You've done enough, really. Just take the money, okay? You got me out of a bad situation back there. Thanks. I'm still gonna need a statement. I have to go drop off what I have. Meet me back at my office, then. It's a little late for an office visit, Sheriff. I'll swing by your apartment. He did just give you 58 you bucks. You live in the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Everyone Isn't that, that, that gets him something, right? Good to know. You should get cleaned up. You look like shit. And I don't use that term lightly. Some of these look pretty bad. I clean up okay. I'll believe it when I see it. Did he pay for, like, future sex? Hey. I need to tell you something. What is it? You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Wait, what's everybody saying about me? I'll see you around, Wolf. See you around, prostitute. <laughs> that was just the beginning.
That was the beginning of the episode. So, so far, I mean... The story is a pretty interesting story. It's a pretty interesting story. Um, the game mechanics are pretty cool. You gotta be quick for some of them. You gotta be quick for some of them. But it's pretty cool. And uh, the characters are pretty cool. I will say that. Maybe I'll have to turn this into a series. This can start in Games with Gold and then evolve into a series. So, this is pretty cool. So we'll play uh, we'll play a little bit more of this, and then uh, we'll call it an episode. And then oh oh I I gotta walk. Did I get it? Okay. Enter. Enter. Can't enter? Okay. Looks like it's locked. It's locked. Look at plaque. Luxury apartment. Oh, okay. So it's the whatever the uh So this wheel here. For those of you who haven't played it before and who might be playing it soon or something. This wheel here is the uh keypad or the Come on. The green screen's flipping out. Um, it's the keypad, so it this one is, is B because it's red. And then the other one was yellow, and the, it was the top, so it was Y. So, just so you guys know. So, we're going to walk up to the... Uh, part. Ooh, there's something right here. Stay off the grass. Sometimes be a disciplinarian. There's no walking on the grass, no white's orders. She made a sign and everything. I'll be sure to send her an apology. Beauty. Beauty. Hello, She's baby. a little drunk. I wasn't expecting anyone. I know this looks a little odd. You're out pretty late. Is there some sort like of beauty from I Beauty and the Beast? About? What's with the third degree? Damn it! I'm late. Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. Yeah. He it's worries too much as it is, and it would just make my life a lot easier. Sure. You promise? I promise. Thank you, Bigby. I'll explain it all to you later. I will, but I have to go. What the hell is she doing there? Thank you for trusting me. Really, I, I appreciate it, Bigby. So is Beast like a possessive asshole?
He pa he's passed out. Hey, you wink? Grimble? Hmm. Probably for the best. Okay. Um. Let's see what we got here. Building directory. Let's check it out. Beast, Mr. and Miss 301. You just go into his apartment or something? I have played the Back to the Future Telltale games too. What is that beast? Bigby, hey, wait up. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Nope, haven't seen her. Oh, okay. Sorry to bother you. Damn it. Something's going on. I trust beauty, right? So I can't I can't tell him where he, where she is. She obviously had a reason to get out of there. It's none of my business, right? <laughs> Put the, let's take the phone off the hook. Is that a good idea? Should we throw it away? Or? At least this still works. So I fired up. It's a little warm in here, you said, right? Should help. Is somebody snoring? Oh. One of the pigs. Dead ass. Got a smoke? <laughs> How many of you have seen a, a pig smoke a cigarette before? You're seeing it. Thanks. Here. A couple thousand more of these will be even on that house you owe me. This has got to stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. 
The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Bigby. Don't be a pain in the ass. I'll tell you what I told Toad. And what's that? Nothing. Because he knows better. Probably. That for me? Nope. The house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh... It would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. It also would have shown everyone how different you are now. If that was all you were saying, I'd be able to get some rest. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. <laughs> this is rude. It wasn't murder. I was hungry. Yeah, well, I'm hungry now. You don't see me tearing the flesh off of your bones. But you would, if you could. Probably. But, uh, no. Um, hate's the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. You ate a lot of people back in your day. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories, either. Look. I'm not saying it's fair, but it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, look at your hands. Just a little bit red. Who'd you get in a fight with? A fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. I was doing my job, believe it or not. Your job is to beat the shit out of fables? Sometimes I take them to the farm. Fuck you. That was, that was rude. You think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. By being big and being bad. Don't say that shit in front of people. It's embarrassing. That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. Everyone. Name one. That's what I thought. Life is easier with friends, Bigby. And we live a long fucking time. I know you like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Well, maybe if my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. Wait, that doesn't make sense. Just give sense. me a drink, please. Colin, enough already. I haven't slept in two days. I went out a second story window, and I want to get in two seconds of shut eye before I. Look, if I give you this, will you let me sleep? Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. Thanks, Big B. Yeah, I'm a nice guy. Sleeps in his chair. Oh, man. Is it Beast? Going on. Sorry, I'm... What is it? What happened? I just can't get into it this second. We need to hurry to... Hi. Hello. Good morning. Or evening. <laughs> yeah. What the hell is that? 
That's Snow White, though, right? These Guessing. walls are paper thin. We need to be careful. We'll talk outside. Okay. Badink! Oh, achievement! There you go, guys. Complete chapter two of episode one. It's a sheriff's jacket or something. Is it a body? What the hell is it? Was she? I thought I knew everyone in Fable Town. She looks familiar. Just a girl. We didn't have a whole lot of time to chat. She got something in her mouth. The woodsman. He attacked her and I stepped in. And he threatened to kill us both. No. You don't think he. I don't think anything yet. Just give me a second. It's just... terrible. So, who found her? Guess he ain't getting no I ass. Didn't. She was just like this. I didn't touch her. I grabbed Grimble's jacket to cover her with. Oh, little then fruit fly. I came to get you right away. No one else was with you? No. Big P, did one of... us... do this? There hasn't been a murder in Fable Town in a long time. All the more reason we shouldn't start a panic before we know what's going on. Have a look around. We don't have much time before people will be coming through here. Yeah, well, there's something in her mouth. Damn, dude. Is that the ribbon? Oh, uh, ribbon. There's some kind of symbol here. Huh. I I don't recognize it. Neither do I. <laughs> Strange cut. What did this to her? What could do something like that? Either something very sharp, or something with magic attached to it. What the hell is that? She was placed here with some care. What do you mean? You can see that someone didn't just toss her here. She was deliberately placed for us to find. What kind of monster would do this? Sorry, this is just so surreal. <sighs> um, what, what do you want to do next? We still have some time. I should keep investigating the area. Okay, good idea. Um... Is there some stuff around here? Can I go around here? Nope. Can't go back here. Okay. This way. Oh, there's blood. Was the body over there?
touch it? Should I touch it? Blood. Drops of blood. I'd say it's been here an hour, maybe. Oh, no. No signs that it's been here long. Fabric. Looks like jeans. Jeans? Doesn't tell me much. Um... Just some loose trash. Yep, more blood. Someone might have hopped the fence, got caught, then left the trail I found earlier. Blood. Still wet. Sharp Touch enough. it. Alright, so I got fabric and a, a ring, apparently. Is there something like up by the front at all? Over here. Nobody there. Anything over here? Nothing. All right. What are you doing? Better to be thorough. Sure, just Sorry. hurry up. We don't have much time. We should move her before anyone shows up. We'll find out more at the business office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. Big P, do you have any idea what's going on? This is a message. A message? I don't know, Bigby. I get complaints at the office all the time, but... Just what about this makes you think that? The victim. She could be a symbol for something. Hmm. Who just puts a head on the front doorstep of I'm a... I'm gonna have to talk to Rain about this. As long as King Cole is gone, he's acting mayor. He needs to know. And he's going to find out anyway. So, we may as well get out in front of it. I guess it's useless to drag it out. That's how I feel too. I'm sure he won't be happy, but... It's just part of the process. Hopefully he can be rational about it. I wouldn't hold my breath. <sighs> I'm not. I just don't want him interfering. Crane's not what's important right now. We need to figure out who this girl was so we can find whoever did this. Take, a take this back to Dr. Swinehart. He can take a look at it. I'll meet you at the business office. That's a damn shame. Alright, so that's gonna save there. Um, Join party. No, thank you. Got another achievement. What are you blind? Long goodbye. Complete what, chapter you don't see three. There's a seven. line. I've been standing here a half hour already. You get to just walk in? Must be nice being the sheriff. Do whatever the fuck you like. I work here. And what great work you do, sheriff. Hmm. That didn't feel very genuine. Ichabod. Fucker. Well, that's rude. You are the one bringing this to me, Miss Snow. The one who so simply stumbled upon this catastrophe. You're not very. Okay. Um. <clears throat> I'm. I. I try. I'm trying not to keep it way too long, but um, the story is getting pretty good. I, I. I dig it. Let me. Um. Let's do this. How about that? So. Um. So far, this game is pretty cool. I will say that. Um. 
I probably will end up making this a series just because um, it's pretty interesting and I want to see what goes on from here. I want to see who put that head there and stuff. And the uh, the story is pretty good. The, I, I like it. The um, We'll see how the how the game mechanics kind of evolve throughout the story, but um, so far everything is pretty cool. And it's totally, totally, well, I wouldn't say worth the $25, I think it said it was, but definitely go and download it because this is this is this is pretty cool it's a pretty cool storyline the graphics are pretty cool um yeah we'll see how the game progresses but i don't want to give it a rating yet because i want to see what happens in story so i'm going to end that here uh, make sure you guys make sure you guys go over and follow my uh twitch channel twitch.tv slash drunk on shadows Make sure you follow me on Facebook and Periscope and Twitter and Instagram and Snapchat and all that. Make sure you guys follow the, the Facebook and the Periscope. If this is the weekend of the 21st, I will be in Boston in, uh, attending PAX East on the Friday. So I'm going to be live streaming from PAX East on Periscope and Facebook for a little bit here and there, and then I'll have a vlog when I get back. So, all right. Make sure to subscribe. Give this channel, or give this, <laughs> give this channel, give this video a like if you liked it, a thumbs up, and tell me if you want to continue with the series, which I probably will anyway, but uh, tell, tell me how you liked it. You thought it was interesting. Are you going to download it? But I'm out. So I will see you next time. Peace!